Hey there, welcome back to our channel where we explore some of the most beautiful places on earth. Today, we're taking you on a journey to the Onduraga Winery in Chile, one of the oldest and most prestigious wineries in the country. As we approach the winery, the first thing we notice is the beautiful surroundings. The Onduraga Winery is located in the stunning Maipo Valley, surrounded by the majestic Andes Mountains. It's easy to see why this is one of Chile's most sought after wine regions. Now, let's take a closer look at the winery itself. The Undurago Winery was founded in 1885 and has been producing some of Chile's finest wines for over a century. The winery has a beautiful colonial style building with an elegant tasting room and the grounds are surrounded by lush vineyards. Touring the grounds of the beautiful estate, we learned that the winery is also home to a stunning collection of pre-Columbian art and artifacts providing a fascinating glimpse into the ancient cultures of the Mapuche people of the Andes. In the case of the Mapuches, they're gonna make it this totem pole, especially for their funerary rites. They believe that when we pass away, they're gonna join us making a, a better connection with our ancestors. begins to walk through the vineyards, we see the grapes growing and learn of the different grape varieties that are used in making wines. Thank you. 
Now, let's visit the winery itself, where we see the entire winemaking process from start to finish. We get to see the grapes being crushed, fermented, and aged in oak barrels before being bottled and labeled. Pretty fascinating. After the tour, we head to the tasting area to sample some of the winery's best wines. The tasting area is elegant and spacious, and the wines are served with a variety of delicious snacks to enhance the tasting experience. We get to taste some of the winery's most popular wines, including their famous Cabernet Sauvignon, Sauvignon Blanc, and Carmenere. Carmenere was once thought to be extinct, but in the 1990s it was rediscovered in Chile, where it had been mistakenly identified as Merlot for over a century. Carmenere has a rich history that dates back to the 18th century when it was brought to Chile by French winemakers. At the time it was commonly used as a blending grape, but it was eventually phased out and forgotten due to its difficulty in ripening and susceptibility to disease. It wasn't until the late 20th century that Chilean winemakers discovered that what they had thought long believed to be Merlot was actually Carmenere. Since then, Carmenere has become a point of pride for Chilean winemakers and a favorite among wine enthusiasts, and I must say our favorite as well. Well, that's a wrap of our tour of the Undurago Winery in Chile. We hope you enjoyed exploring this beautiful winery with us and learning about the winemaking process. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more exciting travel content from our channel and see you in the next video.